So, what is going on, everybody? Today I'm on NHL 16. We're doing a retro NHL video today. I will show you guys a bit of my team and what uh, happened in NHL 16 for me. I wasn't actually recording anything at this point. I never recorded anything until NHL 17. To be quite honest, I didn't really play this game a whole lot. As you can see here, we got a 99 overall John Scott. I remember this card coming out. It was absolutely insane. Everybody had him. He would score on every shot because he was monstrous. Then we've got Patrick Hornquist, I remember, was a beast uh, in NHL 16. Patrice Bergeron, awesome as well. Drysaddle, 85. Domi, 85. I'm pretty sure he's worse than that now, so I don't know what this card is. But he's lower rated two years later, which is insane. Anthony Duclair, player of the game. I think that's a free pack player. Look at this. Panarin and Kuznetsov are so low rated. They're like, Kuznetsov's what, 86? They're both, I think they're both 86 now, so that's insane. And then my fourth line here from 85 rated Mike Ribeiro, that's insane. Roman Yossi and Hamilton are my first line. Charla Tang, Boychuk and Letty. I remember Boychuk was really good. As you can see here, nine unopened packs. I had about 200k when I hopped on here. What I was originally going to do was go into NHL 15, do a retro pack opening. But when I went on to NHL 15, a gold pack cost $399. I don't know if it was a glitch or what, but I'm like, I'm not spending $400 on a shitty gold pack. So I went on here, had 200 k so I didn't even need to spend anything, and we were able to get some stuff. But I'm going to show you guys some of the stuff that I sold throughout the year because I know that... Um, are you able to see it? You're able to see it somehow. Pretty sure you're able to see what you've sold in previous times. Let me see. No. I guess it's too old for me to be able to look at them. Maybe go to the hub and see... No, I guess not. Let me just go to the store and show you guys something pretty funny. 1,400 days remaining on this pack. That is absolutely insane. That is never going to run out. I could do a retro NHL in NHL 21 and probably still be able to buy this mega pack, which is insane. But uh, let's just get into the video here. Open some packs. Just got a nostalgia of NHL 16. I'm getting a gift pack here. I don't really know what's going to be in it. I'm just going to open it up as my first pack. The animation is pretty cool. They don't even have an animation anymore. I don't know why they took that out, but uh, as I'm seeing here, nothing really at all. Fiddlers in the game. I don't, I'm not going to keep any of that stuff. I'm going to save those 35k packs for the end and open up the 17k packs so i'm not really sure what we're gonna get uh we'll have to see here starting off with a uh a rare player over there kempinen trotman i know I'd, i've never heard of this guy ever in my life i guess he never panned out for them but apart from that nothing really that great oh abdicator 84 okay i thought we would have gotten more than one yeah i thought we would have gotten more than one rare player 84 abdicator is not horrible maybe if i get enough quick sell value i'll be able to buy another pack at the end so we're gonna go on a second pack here i'm not gonna do a skip because i really like the animation i want to see it go through we get uh is that a vanek I think it's Vanek. I think he's 84 rated. His shot was disgusting this year, but uh, or last two years ago. There's some cool jerseys. There's a change team, Detroit, and uh, 500 coins. Okay. So three more packs here. Quicksil value is actually really good. We've gotten like 5k ish on every pack, so that's pretty insane. What are we going to get here? A Brian Bickle, Eddie Lack, 85, I see over there. Um, Salamaki as well. Eddie Lack, 85, isn't horrible. So far, uh, we've realized that NHL 16 packs are garbage. NHL 18 packs are way better. Getting 86s all the time. Vlasic and Dupre, okay, not horrible. Vlasic uh, should be higher rated, but he obviously isn't. And apart from that, nothing. Nothing. P.A. Parento is all right, but... Uh, I don't, I don't think any of this stuff goes for anything because nobody plays this game, so I'm just not going to keep any of it. We are at 30k now. We've gotten boosted up quite a bit. I might even be able to get another 35k pack with coins at the end. Actually, I probably will for sure. Dupre again! Again! Oh my god, who's our other rare if we even get one? I think we get like three rares, right? Yeah, so we just got a bunch of random crap. That is sucky wang. I'm going to do a no-looker. First pack, we're going to do a no-looker. You guys are going to see what's coming up. Did we get anything good? It should be open by now, and we will see. I'm going to look now. Off the bat, I'm seeing Jordan Stahl, K85. Not uh, terrible. Those might have been all our rare players, to be honest. To be honest. Uh, Nugent Hopkins, okay. Uh, 1,000 coins. And did we get anything else? No, we didn't. That was also pretty garbage. Let's go through this one. I see a Mark Shifley. And uh, not much else. Haglin. Cracknell. Only 84. 85 has been our best rated player. So, ooh, 88. Zach Parise. Okay. There we go. 
a high rated player. I didn't even see him. I guess he was peeking behind the corner there. But 88, Zach Parise. Last price sold 20k. Okay, I guess I'm keeping him. That is ridiculous. I haven't been looking at the last price sold. I wondered if I got any like sick players worth a lot and I just haven't been paying attention to them. Ivanski's going for a thousand coins. Yeah, right. Let's see anybody else going for anything. Wow, they actually go for quite a bit, but uh, I just don't have the patience to do that. 88 overall, Zach Parise. Not horrible in a uh, 35k pack. And I'm also probably going to have enough. No, I probably won't have enough for two, but uh, oh well. We'll just take a look at this one here. I'm not seeing too many people off the front here. Zadarov straight for 10. And there's a Kuznetsov. Uh, 2k last price sold. Okay, David Clarkson. Uh, I don't think he plays in the league anymore. Nate Prosser. I don't even know if he plays either. Jake for 10 and still hasn't panned out really. Chicago Blackhawks. That's a cool logo with the, with the shiny face. Did we get any players at the back? We didn't. That was a truly a brutal pack. Holy crap. Before I open up the last two packs, I'm just going to go on the market and see what we've got here in respects to how about we don't do bronze. Gold players. What do we got? People are still playing like an hour ago. Come on. What are you doing? Get on the NHL 18. Uh, wow, no high-rated players at all. Oh, there's a Drew Doughty 90 rated, 99k. Shifley Kuznetsov. Couple of player of the game cards there. Um, ooh, Mustat, Movember Weber, that looks ridiculous, holy crap. 98 rated Weber. Last year, I don't know what his highest rated card was, to be honest, I don't know. Cal Clutterbuck's a 90k. So this guy is just boosting his players so much. 92 Clutterbuck, oh my god. So I got another one here with coins. If I get enough quick saw, I might be able to get a, third, a second one after this. Looking at the first little bit here, Panarin, 82 rated, so he's not that great. If uh, if that was last year or the year before, he would have a higher rated card. Is he even going for anything? 6k, wow, people are actually selling him? That is ridiculous. Anyways, uh, anything else in the pack? I'm not really expecting anything. There's a Yemelin, and it looks like that is all. 1,000 coins. As you can tell by my record, I really didn't play this game. 50, 23, and 1. Not a whole lot. I'm only in Division 3. Let me uh, go to my collection and see if Zach Parise is going for anything. Zach Parise, our best player. What is his... Uh, Wow, he's not even, oh, 20k? Okay, well, I'll put him up for 20k then. 19k, maybe if I come back in two years time, he'll have sold. So that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys did enjoy this Retro NHL and you wanna see another video of Retro NHL, maybe I'll do something else in NHL 16, NHL 15, NHL 14 even. Let me know down below what you think. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to hit that like button if you're new around here and you wanna see more NHL content. Hit that subscribe button, but for now, I'll see you in the next video.